Okay, we're here in Armenia with Fuller Housing, uh, building homes with the poor people in Armenia. And Fuller Housing in Armenia, these are people, this is an outfit that gives interest-free loans to the poor population. You know, in Armenia, there are at least 150,000 people who are either homeless or live in temporary shelter. Uh, my friends, that we can never have that. And so we're here building a couple of homes. And speaking first, out of the 12-person team, we have the group leader, um, Apo, and he wants to say a few words about the project that we're doing. Hello. The reason I come here to do this for Fuller is because of the people here. Uh, I feel that it's necessary for me to give back to, the, to my motherland to help out my people uh, in every which way I can. These people are wonderful people. They're very friendly. They're very loving, generous, and kind. And the way I can repay them back is by helping them with their homes. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Next person up is uh, Daniel, our youngest member, <laughs> hardest worker. Before he drops dead now, he's going to say a few words. I, uh, I came to Armenia because uh, I'm half Armenian myself, so it's very important uh, for me to see uh, the country, my heritage, and I couldn't think of a better way to do it than uh, with Fuller, where I had you know, some vacation, but also uh, helping out the people as well. Right. And it, had, uh, it has a great impact on me. I, I can see that I'm really helping out the people, and what better way to do it than with my family. What a great ministry. What a great ministry in living the gospel. Right. And here we have Mark Avak. Hello, how are you? <laughs> I'm uh, here with my family. My, it's been an um, extreme pleasure to be in their company. Um, it reminds me that my family, my extended family, or my, my parents, my grandparents, uh, and my parents viewed this as, um, as a homeland, as, as a second homeland for my parents, as a second homeland for me. And it's... Up. And by by thinking in those terms, I see this whole country as an extended family. So it's um, it's a pleasure to take come out of the prosperity of my own home, come come here, help people who are in need to furnish their houses, um, make them a, a comfortable uh, life, and um, it's 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 one and the same as helping a family member. Yeah, yeah, all one family. Yeah. And here we have uh, Carrie. Um, who's going to say a few words and why she said the impact? I grew up hearing um, stories from my grandmother about coming to America. and I have a serving heart, so I came here to serve in the country that my ancestors are from with 11 of my cousins and a leader. Um, all my cousins are from my grandmother and her sister who came to America came here to serve. Hey, hey, and that's what it's about. It is, hey, living the gospel, Christ ordered us. He ordered, he didn't ask us, he ordered us to help the poor and to be one with the poor. And and as was said, we came here to serve. We came here to understand that we came with family, but everybody is our family, especially in Armenia, working with Fuller Housing. Uh, and St. Master has had the pleasure of um, building, coming here period lots of times, right, Abe? Absolutely. We've been here lots of times. We've Absolutely. had that pleasure and honor to serve. Uh, St. Mesuop has donated about eight homes on top of that. And um, what a beautiful ministry in living the gospel. And the home we're going to pan over to now was donated by the Edward Hamparian Fund. And... These people will be in their home before the end of the year. And it's a fantastic home. This home will last for generations and generations. And this home will be home for the next hundred years for the family, these families and the families to follow. Thank you for tuning in. Take care.